Hey guys, Pulsar, welcome back to another Digimon Rise video, and today we're making this video because I've been seeing some really, really bad takes out there, <laughs> and yeah, I'm trying to hopefully warn folks of something to, that people have been saying that they're doing, and um, they probably shouldn't be doing, so that is in regards to the BP Shop. So the BP Shop re recently got an upgrade, which is very welcome, you know, I welcome upgrades, I want, I like new stuff. But it's a uh, pretty terrible upgrade, I'd have to say. So, the BB Chop recently added a lot of skill shards, skill stone shards, and all that. And you, know, you got one of every type in small, and then one of every type in large. And a lot of people have been saying, "Oh, you know, I'm gonna exchange my um my 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 BP for like calm calm skill stones and freaking uh brave skill shards, whatever." And that is a terrible, terrible, terrible idea. Do not do this. Do not do this. These are absolute trash. <laughs> Don't buy these. <laughs> like, look at these prices. Like, first of all, the chance of this increasing your skill level is extremely small <laughs> to begin with. And it costs 100 BP. Like, look how much BP. Like, BP is so rare in this game. I'm in, like, I'm in top 500 right now, and that only gives me, like, 95 BP when the season ends. Obviously, there's more BP to be earned because, you know, every day you get a set of reward BP, right? And then you also got, you know, sometimes from missions you could pick up BP and all that stuff. But that doesn't give you the excuse to spend them on straight-up garbage like these skills shards. <laughs> <laughs> Again, if you already bought them, I'm I'm not trying to you know dogpile on you or whatever. Although it's, that's actually a really weird word to use over there. But you know, just don't 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 buy these. Um, even the large ones, which again they have a slightly better chance of raising your skill uh, level, but still, it's not guaranteed. It's not like 100% raising it. And these are 250. Holy crap, 250 BP for each like an egg with an ultimate digimon is only like what um that guarantees at least an ultimate there's like a small chance to get a mega from these these are only like 100 bp and then you know if you get them to ultimate and then you sell them for for orbs you get 50 orbs which is what um 16th percent of a full slate or slab, or whatever, or full, fully formed skill stone, right here, right in comparison, and it's it's just better to get one of these in comparison than one of these. Even though again, these are cheaper to get in comparison to release, you know, raising and releasing ultimates, but uh, again, they're they're. There's just not worth it because it's not a guaranteed chance. And I'm not saying that to tell people to buy these because these are trash. Do not buy any of these. Do not buy this. Do not buy this. Do not buy this. The only thing, don't even buy this. The only thing in this shop that you should be getting, and it's not even you. Know, it's not. It's not even something. I shouldn't even have used the word should. That you could get is the this the Gankumon egg. Aside from this, everything else is hot trash. Don't get any of these eggs. Don't get any of these skill stone shards. Don't get this, whatever this is. I don't even know what's in here, but don't get it. <laughs> oh, let me see. Just a bunch of food. Not even great food. <laughs> um, some chips. And one stamina drink. Okay, if it was like 20 stamina drinks, and you know, we're having a conversation here. But <laughs> it's, it's only one stamina drink. Uh, but, you know, the only one you should get is Gankmon, which is, again, you know, one of the best Digimon in the game. Um, at the moment. So, if you want to get anything, save up for this Gankamon. And don't get multiples. Just get one and then be done with it. I mean, I, if you really want multiples, I can't really stop you, I guess. But, at least get one. Or, at most, get one. At least get zero. If you don't... If your team is winning, you're doing good in the battle park, you don't even need Gankamon. Um, but, obviously, Gankamon. One of the best <laughs> units in game would help a lot. But, the reason why you shouldn't get anything from the store, it's not like... And, and you know you, you might be saying, "Oh, post, come on! Like, what what the hell? I am, am I just gonna sit here with thousands of BP and just not 
you know, use them on anything. Like, it's not like you could use them on anything else, right? Wrong. You can use them on other things, uh, except they just haven't came to the game yet. They will come to the game later. Save up for those. So what would be coming to the game are rainbow plugins. Rainbow plugins, 250 each. So for the for the price of one of these trash. <laughs> Okay, they're not actually that terrible, but, you know, <laughs> I'm being too hard on them. But, you know, for one of these skill stone shards, large skill stone shards, you could get a rainbow plugin. And these are, these are, these are Digimon specific rainbow plugins, but they're not like some, you know, some random Digimon. It's not like, oh, you know, they're throwing a plugin for freaking Numemon or whatever, Andromon. They're not doing it for like rando, like freaking... Metal Greymon. They're not doing it for rando ultimates. They are giving out mega, summonable mega plugins. Includes stuff like Daemon. For those who are, you know, just looking at their roster, trying to improve it right now. They're throwing out stuff for Daemon. They're rainbow plugins for Piedmon. Rainbow plugins for Minervamon. Rainbow plugins for Hyandramon. Rainbow plugins for. I don't think no Plumpkamon because JP never really got no Plumpkamon until like recently. Well, not extremely recently, you know, just when Global came out. But you know, um, some other stuff. But more importantly, they have Rainbow plugins for future units, future meta changing units like Omnimon or Megamon, whichever you want to call it. You know, All Force Vidramon, um, Alphamon, if you're into that, I guess. Although, I'm personally not a huge fan of Alphamon in this game. I like Alphamon as a Digimon. I don't like... I, I, I think they, they kind of did Alphamon dirty in this game. Uh, but, you know, just whatever else other, you know, extremely good Gaiomon Digimon that you're going to get. Um, Imperial Digimon, uh, Pal Paladin mode, right? So, you're going to... You want to save up for those Rainbow plugins. Those Rainbow plugins, like, a lot of people just keep on asking me, Oh, how can I improve my PvP team? How can I improve my Battle Park team? And a lot of those people who are, are asking me just are uh, under-equipped on plugins. Plugins are extremely, extremely port important. They're as important as what Digimons you use in your team. They're extremely, extremely important. And good plugins versus bla bad plugins versus no plugins is a huge, huge difference, right? So again, save up for plugins, rainbow plugins, right? Like, and, and that's, that's like stuff that you like have to summon for regularly, like, right? Like, and you can't even, like, at the, at the moment, globally, you can't even get them. Like, like we got, like, one rainbow plugin summon, and it was, like, absolute garbage in terms of the rainbow plugins. They're all, like, single stat rainbow plugins. Not that, not even that great. But uh, mostly, you, you do want to save for those rainbow plugins. Don't buy any of this garbage. Save for the rainbow plugins, and you will you will not be disappointed when, when they come. So, um, that aside... There's also some more stuff. You know, they throw some random stuff in there. You know, this will expand immensely um, when when they add more stuff in here. But there's also other Mega Eggs. Um, like, JP has, I think, has like a... I might be wrong on this, but I think they have a, a, a Kentaurus spawn um, Mega Egg. It could be for, from something else. But the one I do remember... Um, a hundred percent is they they have a Leviathan, uh, Mega Egg, which you could also get as well. But since JP and Global's eggs have been like different, so I wouldn't you know bank on a hundred percent. You know, it's going to be what JP gives. It's not like hundred percent going to be Leviathan or something. Um, they might switch it up, but you know they they'll have other mega eggs in here, right? That you probably want to spend as well. I think they're the same price as the Ganku egg, right? You know, if they throw in like a, you know, a BP, a a a, a Battle Park, you know, Evil Trubimon. Okay, <laughs> I only said that because I like Evil Trubimon or Trubimon or or whatever, you know, right? Um, then would be a shame if you spent it on stuff that isn't even guaranteed to level up your, you know, Digimon skill level, right? Um, so again. Moral of this video, save your BPs, you know, just because these are new doesn't mean they're good. Um, save your BPs, rainbow plugins, don't don't screw yourself with that, <laughs> okay? So, anyways, um, that's me for this one. Mini rant slash suggestion video, more so suggestion than a rant, even though 
I probably went a bit over with the rant. Um, I do apologize if I did. Wasn't really my intention, I guess. Uh, but yeah, um, f uh, the the BP stuff, save, save, save. Um, Christmas stuff, buy everything. <laughs> um, if, if you guys want, I could do a separate video on what to prioritize for the Christmas stuff. But it's like it's pretty straightforward. Get the Meg egg, and then everything else is, you know, everything else is just extra gravy stuff so anyways again that's me for this one i hope you guys enjoyed it let me know what you guys think in the comments down below like enjoy this video subscribe to your channel for some more Jimon rios content and i'll see you guys in the next one